गुड इवनिंग कैन यू हियर मी How was your day today? It was fine. And good. You? Uh, I had a good day, thank God. Thanks for asking. I woke up really early. Uh, well, not really early, like about almost <laughs> 6 a.m. with no alarm. You know, I rested well. And then I began with my with my activities. Okay, it's good. Yeah, yeah, so that's that's how we went today. Okay, so we have Maria Luisa, Williams, and Andrea. Yes. All right, so today, what's today's date? What's today's date? And it's Tuesday? Yes, Tuesday is correct. Tuesday. Uh -huh. What date? Uh, 21st. 20? <laughs> 28. Okay, Sorry. yes, 28. 20. Yes, 28. <laughs> And what's the year? Uh, 2020. 2020. Very good. All right. Um, 2020. This, yeah, 2020. You can say 2020, 2020. We got two options for, for the year. Okay, so let's talk about yesterday. Do you remember the topics we covered yesterday? Yes, about... Yes. Uh, uh, we'll talk about... Possessives. Okay, so possessives was one of them. Can you mention examples of possessives? My, your, his, my, his, her, it, are, okay. there. Okay, good. When do we use there? Uh, when, uh, when, uh, when, when the, when, when the when the subject is pro it's plural, but we are not included. Right. When the subject is plural, but we are not included. So you you say they. Yeah. You use they. Right. Okay. Um. What else did we talk about? What else did we mention? Um. Maria, Eric, Felipe, Ivan, Andy, Claudia, Nelly, Nelson. What else did we mention yesterday? Uh huh. I'll talk about introduce me. Okay, yes, you were talking about introductions. That is correct. And what kind of information do you share when you introduce yourself? Name, age. Okay, name, age. Where you live. Okay, good, very good. All right, um, anything else? So we, you mentioned possessive adjectives, introducing yourself, anything else? The conversation. Yes, we read conversations. How many conversations did we read? We have read the conversation. Two. Yes. Two. Do you remember the first conversation? What was the content in it? Um. The girl and boy, it, a boy and was a, a party. Okay, they were in a party. What about the second conversation? Uh, to students, people, to people about, in, about the to, uni, in the university. Student. Two students, two people in the university. Two people. 
yes. to people in the university. Okay. Uh, they are going to to their classes, their class, and, and okay. after <laughs> they finish in, uh, going to the cafeteria. I, yes. I mean. Yeah, the girl, she was going to the cafeteria and she invited the guy. And the guy says, sure, let's go. All right, um, do you have any questions about yesterday? Any questions? No. Okay. Uh, part, no. of, part of the review that we have for today is um, we're going to make questions with am, is, are. Remember that am, is, are, they have exactly the same function. The only difference is the personal pronoun that you use. So you say she is the president, um, he is the president, I am the president, you are the president. They have exactly the same function. The only difference is the person that you mentioned. Can you give me a question using am, is, are, one of the three? Um, what's your name? Okay, what is your name? Okay, what else? Who is he? Who is he? Uh-huh. What else? Where are you from? Where are you from? Mm -hmm. What about the others? Felipe, Lorraine, Geraldine, Evelyn, Melvin. What do you live? Where do you live? Okay, in that case, do when you live? say, where do you live? You are using do and does. So you're supposed to make questions using am, is, or are. How old are you? How old are you? Okay, good. What else? About positive things uh, is, is the computer yours? Okay, is the computer yours? Very good. Anything else? Felipe? All right, so you have M is R. It's something that you guys already manage pretty well. So, um, now we go to our reading exercise. Do you guys read? Do you read? Yes. Okay. What, what, ki what kind of reading do you like to do? About story? About history? About history. Anywhere in particular or history in general? Um, history about wars. Okay. All right. Anybody else? Currently, I'm reading a, a book that is called uh, "Word of of Energy." It is read about uh, in chemical energy or nuclear energy. Okay. Good. Good. Anybody else? Is, is anybody else reading anything at this moment? No. Oh. No, I don't read. Okay, yeah. you're not reading anything. Okay, fine. All right, so let me show you the, the image. Let's see right here okay do you see the image yes yes, yes what, i see what's, this. what's what's the topic what's in a what, name? name what's, what's in, in a name, name? Uh -huh. if i ask you this question what's in a name what would be your answer A uh, name, it's your identity. <laughs> okay, yeah, your name is your identity, definitely, yes. What else is in a name? Mm -hmm. 
a name uh, specifically, especially when we are speaking about names, we're talking about. Uh, yes. Uh, it's an important part of your identify. Yes, it's an important part of your identity. Yes. Anybody else? What's in a name? All right. So first we name, have... last name. Okay, first name, last name. How do you say segundo nombre in English? Middle name. Middle name. Uh -huh. Second name. Okay. Uh, you might say second name, and people, I'm pretty sure people will understand, but the real um, word is middle name. Mi middle name. Middle. Nombre de en medio. Middle. middle name. Yes. Middle name. Now, how do you say apellido? Last, Last name. Last name. Or? What is another form to say last name? Surname. What is it? Surname. 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 But surname is British. So they say my first name is Francisco and my surname is Marroquin. So a person from England will say surname instead of last name. Okay. okay, so we have three, four, five different small paragraphs. Actually, six with the, with the introduction. I, I need one volunteer to read the introduction. Hello, my name is... <laughs> uh -huh. Maria, can you please read the introduction? Hi, what is your name? Uh huh. Look at the names. Look at the hmm. names in the article. Uh huh. Do you know any people with these names? What are they like? Okay, good. Uh, someone else read the first part. Your name okay. is very important. Okay. Yes, please. I'm gonna do. Right. Said, your name is very important when you think about your of yourself. You probably think of your name first. It's an important part of your identify. Identity. Uh, right now. Mo yeah, identity. Uh -huh. Excuse me. Uh, right now, the two most popular names for ba for for babies in the United States are Jacob, and for boys are for boys and Emily for girls. Why are these names popular and why are so names popular? Unpopular. Very good. Thank you. Another volunteer. Hi. Your name Hi. is very important when you think of yourself. It think of your name first. It's an important okay, part of where, where are your you, Andy? Advice. What which paragraph are you reading? First, uh, not the. You're supposed to read, you uh, to read paragraph three, three paragraph three. Okay. Names can become. Uh, names can become popular because of famous actors, TV, or book characters, or adjective. Athletes. Uh, popular names. Like athletes. Uh, popular names such as very positive. Things on popular names such as negative things. Surprisingly, surprisingly, people generate surprisingly, surprisingly uh -huh. people generally agree on the way they feel about the feel about names. Here, here are some common opinions about names from a uh, recent sur survey. Thank you, thank you. Any questions on the part uh, she just read? Hmm. No? I mean, surprisingly, 
Surprisingly. 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 Yes, surprisingly. surprisingly. Any other questions you may have? The TV or book? The, the next word? Yes, characters. Characters. Yes, characters. Character. Thank you. Characters, sure. the people that is they stay in the on the on the books per, or yeah. or a TV program perform on one of the, the characters. Yes. You know a character is a personaje in, in, in Spanish. Right. Okay, any other questions you may have about uh, what we have read so far? Okay, no. so I need another volunteer to read the names for boys. Read the name and what the definition okay, is. I will do it. Okay, yes, please. Okay. Okay, boy's name, George, Average, Boring, Jacob, Creative, Friendly, Michael, good looking, athletic, Stanley, nerdy, serious. Okay, good. Any questions about what uh, our friend just read? Average, boring, creative, friendly, good looking, athletic. Average. 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 Promedio. Yes, promedio. Exactly. Any other questions? No? No. Okay, so let's go. What is it? Nerdy? It's like in Spanish when you call someone nerdo. Yeah, nerdy. Nerdo intelligent. Yes, usually when you when you call someone nerdy, it's another form to intelligent. Yes. All right. Um, another volunteer to read the girls' names, please. Names: Betty, old-fashioned, average, Emily, independence, adventures, Jane, plain. Ordinary, Nicole, beautiful, intelligent. Good, very good. So we have old fashioned, average, independent, adventurous, plain, ordinary, beautiful, and intelligent. Any questions there about pronunciation or definition? Yes, the definition of the word plain. Okay, plain is like, um, there are synonyms with ordinary. Mm. There are synonyms. Common. Yeah, common, like whatever. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Any other questions by anybody else? No. Okay. No. And I need one last volunteer to read uh, the last paragraph, please. Me. Me. Okay. Me. Okay, I had three me's. Whoever <laughs> wants to do it, that's fine. Me. Go ahead. So, why do parents give their children unpopular names? The biggest reason is tradition. Many people are named after a family member. Of course, opinions can change over time. A name that is, un that is unpopular now might become popular in the future. That's good for all the, the Georges and Bettys out there. Okay, good, thank you. Any questions there? No. Are you happy with your name? Yes. 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 A lot. yes. I'm happy with my name too. A lot. All 
right. Um, any questions about the reading? Yes, I am. We just finished. No questions. No? No. Okay. So um, let me ask you, how many grammatical tenses do we have in English? Twelve tenses. Twelve tenses. Twelve is correct. Just like Pamela says, we have twelve tenses in English. Do you know the names of those twelve tenses? Do you know the names? No, I don't yes, know. Yes, no, maybe. No, no. Okay, so let me break out rooms. We have 18 people, I'm going to make nine groups. And before we go with today's practice, uh, I want you to work together and see how many names you can mention about the 12 tenses that we have. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Yes. 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 All right, yes. here we go. Nelly and Ivan. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Hi, thank you. And you? Okay, I'm doing okay. Thank you. Did you guys have a good day? Uh, boring. Boring. Okay. A, re a regular day. A regular day. All right, good. So, um, just talk about the names that you know about the 12 tenses. Simple present, simple past, past continuous, blah, 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 and so on. Go ahead. Okay. Sí, es que no, no escuché muy bien la pregunta. No sé si logras escucharla. No, 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 tampoco. Se ha levantado. Sí. So, did Sorry, you guys teacher. mention? Did you mention the names of the 12 tenses? Did you? No. No. No, not yet. All right. I just remember, I, I just remember also maybe three tenses. Okay, that's fine. Just mention the three that you remember. No. Uh, present. Le preguntamos. Yes, ask me. I don't know what I have to do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I asked you how many grammatical tenses we have in English. And Pamela said 12. So before we start reviewing with one today, I want you to mention the names that you remember. Uh, but Only yeah, mention I the names. Simple present, past continuous, future continuous. Uh, answer, answer. Oh, only mention the names, only the names. The verbs, the, the verbs. No, tenses, tenses. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, let me see this here. Um. 
For example? <laughs> uh, simple pass, pressing continues. I don't remember. Name of the 12 tenses. Just present, past, and future. Okay, that's three. <laughs> Tomo that's three. Tomorrow. <clears throat> Tomorrow I'm not going to I remember the oh, the the structure is subject a uh, verb to be and the verb with I and G at the end. Yes. Simple future we just just uh, use the going to or or will and in the simple past we use the auxiliary didn't auxiliary did but in negative and question okay. and I eat yo estoy comiendo mm -hmm. I'm eating I eating I'm Eating. I eating. I'm eating. Eating. Yes. And um, simple future, I think. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's correct. How it's many did you mention? Uh, like six. six okay. Six or seven. All right. Good. Mm -hmm. So let's let's return to the main session. Okay. okay. <clears throat> Bye. How many tenses did you and your friend were able to mention? About six. How about six? About six. six. Okay. Six. All right. Remember that we have 12 tenses. Every yeah. tense has a different function. Every tense has a different structure. And it's very necessary that by the time we finish this course, not this level, but all the course, you guys are very familiar with the 12 tenses. Because the 12 tenses uh, give you a lot of information help you become more fluent and it will give you more options to speak faster okay thank you okay um so let's go to um let's see where is this right here chat okay let me write the first one simple present do you see the chat Yes. Okay, can you put the other ones there, please? Sí. Okay, pressing continues, simple pass, very good. What progressive? Else? Yes, present progressive. Well, present progressive is the same as present continuous. Okay, what else do we have? Present perfect continuous, yes. Anything else? Two, four, six, eight. All right. That's fine. You guys don't need to know the names. However, you guys need to know how to use each one of them. Now you have present, past, and future. You have to be like very specific, like simple present, uh, simple past, simple future. Present perfect, past perfect, future perfect and so on. You guys gotta be very specific. So let me show you the image that I have for today. 
No les puedo decir. No hay o como decirle. Define this here. Share. And we go here. Okay, do you see the image? Yes. 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 What's yes. the name yes. of the conversation? Yes. Where do, you Where, do you Where do you work? Where do you work? Where do you work? Yes. And that is one question that you ask when you are introducing yourself or when you see someone first time in, in a lot of years. Where do you work? Now, if you analyze the picture, what can you say about the picture? Guy, it's a guy. Okay. What are they An doing? Travel guy. An exciting yeah, work to and a worthy work. Okay. What is their work? If that's their work, what's the name? The fast, fast, uh, fast food, fast food. and the, fast food? the work uh -huh. name is uh, um, Hamburger Heaven. Okay, Hamburger Heaven. Right. Do you guys like hamburgers? Yes. So, so. Not too much, but so, I, so. I, I... Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hamburgers are delicious. So-so. Mm. Um, yeah, it mm. depends where you go. Everybody has different <laughs> likes and dislikes. Okay. So we have one person. I prefer Chinese food. <laughs> you like Chinese food better? It's very, yes. very, very good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's, I, oh, I, can food eat, Chinese food. <laughs> I can eat Chinese food. Chinese food is good. It's not my first option, but, you know, it, it's pretty good. Okay, so we have this person here that he works at a fast food place. What kind of food do they sell exactly? Fast food? Hamburgers. 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 What, hamburgers. what are the ingredients in a hamburger? Bread. 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 Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes. Yeah. All right. Sometimes. Now, what does the hamburger have here? Nice. Wings. 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 And where is the hamburger located? In a cloud. In a cloud. Exactly. And what is this here? <laughs> that is hail. That's Halo. 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 Yes, Halo. Okay. Let me write it in the chat, in the WhatsApp chat. It's called Halo. It's a H I. It's H A L L O. Oh, oh, only one O. Only one L. Only one L. Only one L. Right? Yes, Halo. Halo. It's the same as the video game. Yeah, it, I know that uh, there is a, a video game that's called Hello. Okay, but that video game has double L. I don't remember that. It's Hello okay. is bright with double L or, or one L only. Okay. But I think it's one L only. All right. One, one L, one L. All right, good. Yeah, so yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the same one as... The, the picture that we're seeing here. So who has halos? Angels. Angels, exactly. Angel. Angels have halos, yes. Okay, um, what else do you see in the fast food restaurant? What do you see? Mm. <clears throat> How do you say bandeja in English? A cashier, right? Bandeja in English? 
Mm, no, Trey. I don't know. <laughs> no. Trey. 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 Yes, Trey. T -R -E Trey. T-R-A-Y. Uh -huh. Yeah. And it's, and it's the same word. Okay. It's the same word that you use when you're talking about your email. Okay. So they say, look, I Trey. didn't receive your email. And they say, check in your junk tray. In your junk tray. Yeah. All right. Uh, oh, what about tray. this? What, yeah, tray. So you use the word tray when you're talking about you're in a restaurant or also when you're talking about your email. Okay. Uh huh. What about the second picture? For that that word. <laughs> where, where are they? In, in a mountain. 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 Peru. Okay. Climb. Sí. Yeah, adventurous. Sure. Now, climb in a mountain. In the yeah. Mountain. Right. Sí. Now, what is your equipment if, if you work as a tourist guide? What is your equipment? And sleeping bag, a uh, backpack, a uh -huh. hat, boots, yes. a uh, hat, bottle, uh, boots, a bo box killer. <laughs> okay. So the real name is Canteen. Canteen. Canteen is the container that you have to put water. Canteen Plora. Yes, exactly. Canteen. Canteen, right. All right, do you have any questions about the picture? No? No. All right, so I'm going to read it one time. You guys pay attention. Um, what are you supposed to do if you need a comma? Repeat, please. Uh, what repeat? are you supposed to do pause. when you see a comma? Right. You make a pause. You make a pause. What happens, what happens to your intonation if you see a question mark? Like what happens? Asking something. Right, your intonation yes. has to be different, like if you're asking something. What about the, 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 the exclamation mark? What happens to your intonation? Excited. Your intonation will increase. Right, your intonation will increase. All right, so just pay attention and let me know if you have any Hold on. All right. It says, where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part-time job too. Oh, where do you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Any questions there? No. Sorry, sorry teacher. Yes. I forgot the difference between Work and job. Okay, work is trabajar, job is empleo. It's ah, okay. empleo. Thank yeah, you. but they're but they're connected. They're connected. Okay. All right. Anybody else? Any other questions? No. 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 Okay. I think I have this picture here. I should. Camera. Yes, I have it right here. 
nine to ten. Did you receive it? Yes. 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 Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'm going to put you to work in pairs. Um, you have the image in the WhatsApp group, or you can take a picture right now if you're uh, using your computer. It doesn't matter which way you want to do it. So let me arrange you here, breakout rooms, open rooms. Here we go. Hi. Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Good. Hello. Hello, Ivan. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, so start practicing the conversation. Okay. Um, the pictures. Okay. Oh man, I'm, I feel a little sleepy. <laughs> okay, uh, are you ready to start? Ready. Okay, uh, which character do you want to be, to perform, excuse me, to perform? Nelson? Nelson? Hello, Nelson. Nelson, are you there? No. Nelson, can you hear me? Teacher, I, I think that Nelson cannot hear me. Yes, I think he has he has issues with the sound. Perdón, no. excuse me, que es, tengo un problema técnico ahí. Oh, okay, good. Uh, no. Okay. Eh, ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer? Perdón, eh, me perdí. You, you're going to read the Don't conversation. Worry. Ah. Yeah, it's very yeah. simple. You have to perform one of those characters. Yeah, it's very simple. There, you have to perform only one of those characters. Uh, which one do you want to perform? Yep. Sorry, my English is very bad, pero... No, don't um, worry. Don't worry, don't worry. Performance like actuar como uno de esos eh, dos personajes. Ah, vamos a la práctica. Yeah, entonces. only read, yes, only read. Oh, only read, ah, okay. Yes. Yeah, only yeah. practice. Hay I, I, Jason? Jason? Yeah, Jason. Okay. Jason, de oración en el ejercicio yo le puse este yo le puse respuesta larga en teoría no ¿Qué? sé si estaba equivocado pero ya le digo puse 
que, que, que preguntaba si vivía en Estados Unidos, la primera. Sí, eso es Estados pues, Unidos. Eh, no. Ajá. I, I'm not live in United States, pero siempre me daba error. Ahí. No sé, bueno, voy a tratar igual más tarde. Hello, teacher. Hello, you, you guys finished? Yes. All right. Let me bring everybody back. Okay. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part time job too. How interesting. Uh, mm -hmm. La otra palabra era. So, so, so American, so. like Peru. Seguimos, quizá, pero porque no he puesto todavía ahí. Ahora, John Jackson. Where do you work, Andrea? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do? I'm a guy. I take on tours. Hey, it's a teacher. Yes, hey, teacher. Yes, ask me. No, no, no questions. I'm talking about the, your uh, old jokes. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, yes. I, I in work office in the in the evening. The people say me, hey, I I listen to the the bread. <laughs> What do you mean they listen to the bread? Uh, the the bread vendor. <laughs> oh, the vendor. <laughs> yes. Okay. And people ask me, I do work from your office to your home. Yes. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm at home. <laughs> exactly. I'm hungry. Uh, wait a minute. I, I need some bread. <laughs> right. Right. Good. You guys finish already? Yes. Yes. All right. So let's bring everybody back. Okay. Did everybody have the chance to finish uh, practicing the conversation? Yes. 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 All right. Yes. All right, do you have any yes. questions uh, concerning pronunciation or meaning of the vocabulary? No, I don't have. No, I don't have. Okay. No, I don't have. All right, so let me ask you, what do you do in particular to improve your English when we are not in class? What do you do to practice and improve? Watch, um, watch, watch, watch uh, YouTube video, videos. Videos. Uh, listen songs. Listen to music, yes. On oh, real short watch news. Watch TV in English. Watch TV in English, good. Oh, read book. Uh, read books, very good. Uh, the most what I do to improve my English is it's read. I really love to read <laughs> and Good. play on Duolingo. Have some Good. part of that, that, that application of that, that app. Hey. Hey. Good. Great idea, Alan. <laughs> yeah, that's a great idea. You know, like read. Reading has uh, yeah, I, has magic. Yes, yeah. Alan. Yeah, I I read and, and I I have I have the the plus version in Duolingo. If someone else wanted to play in that oh. application, I can give for the group. Oh, good, good. Yeah, maybe you want to share it in the WhatsApp group. Okay, I will do. Good. Anybody else? Any other suggestions that you may do to improve your English? 
I like I like to practice with some videos in YouTube. The name of the videos is Shadowing. Okay. Good. And what exactly do you do there, Nelly? In YouTube. Uh-huh. What exactly do you do? I I saw a teacher and and I I'm reading and and I'm talking and also I repeat. All right, good. Anybody else wants to share what you guys are doing to improve your English? Uh, sorry, teacher. I, I have sent the 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 get get on the WhatsApp group. If uh, to install only, I. I give you some little indication. If you had the free version of Duolingo, you must to uninstall the, ver the free version. And you have to install uh, the application that I have shared in, in, in WhatsApp to right. get the plus version. I have already paid that the plus version, don't worry. Oh, okay. All right, good. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, it says Duolingo Premium. All right, good. Thank okay. you, Alan. Thank you. I share a YouTube channel. It's uh, very simple songs. It's songs in English for childs. Okay. Good. Anybody else? Um, change your cell phone language, teacher. Good. Yes. You know, like little things, small things that you might be like, yeah, but that's not going to help. That's not going to make any difference. It, it makes a difference. It helps. Yes, you 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 let you read uh, automatic letter. Right, letter. right, right. <laughs> unfortunately, unfortunately, my my phone is only in, in English. <laughs> oh, okay. That that's even better. <laughs> that's yeah. even better. Can you share some book titles? To read? Sure, sure. I I will. Uh, say. Yeah. Yep. And sometimes thinking English. What is it? Sometimes uh, thinking English. Sure, sure. You or have... speak with me in in front of mirror. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yes, that's, that's, that's a good idea. You know, talk to yourself in front of a mirror. That, that's really good. Also, when you start thinking in English, that is also really helpful. So that is good. Yeah, it, 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 it is really helpful. I also did it. <laughs> yeah. And it helps. It helps a lot. It, it's helping. It's helpful. Sure. Yeah. Yes. Anybody else wants to share some of the activities you guys do? We no? learn some, 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 uh, so how you say, cancion, no, songs. Songs, um, learn songs. Learn, uh, uh, song, uh, yeah, song lyric, yeah. Learn oh. song lyric. Okay, good, good. Karaoke time. Yeah, karaoke. Yes, karaoke helps karaoke, too. Karaoke, yes. Exactly. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to finish here right now. Um, if you don't have any other questions, we continue tomorrow, same place, same time. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you. Good, good night. night. Bye. 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 Bye.